Without objection. Madam Speaker, thank you. The, uh, it's tough economic times, and almost every family, every business back in my district knows in tough times you've got to sit down and put pen and pencil to uh, pen to paper and figure out a budget so you know where you stand and, and where you're going. But right now, people at home find it unbelievable that they're sitting down and going through this tough process, but we in Congress are not. Until this year, we've never failed to pass a budget since the Budget Act was put into place in 1974. In fact, it is astonishing, astonishingly insensitive of the Democratic leadership to not do a budget this Congress. Why, earlier this year, President Obama himself said in January, like any cash-strapped family, we will work within a budget to invest in what we need and sacrifice what we don't. So why not do a budget this year? I can't understand it. My folks back home can't either. Last week, Brian Garlett of Flower Mound, Texas, posted on my Facebook page, where is our budget, Congressman? This is unacceptable. Well, I agree with Brian. It is unacceptable that this year of all years, Congress will not work on a budget. I the yield back. The gentleman's time has expired.